Shalom brothers and sisters, trans daycare worker. Now just before I even carry on, how is that even a thing in the world we're living in? That is how dark and evil this world has become. That is how we're living in the days of Lot. Trance daycare worker. They shouldn't be anywhere near kids. How? How? Where are the parents on this? Do you even know who's looking after your children? Trans daycare worker handed 25 years in prison for sexually exploiting kids. Wow, shocker. A woman identifying as a man and working at a daycare center in San Francisco has been handed 25 years in prison for sexually exploiting children in her care. Now let me just say, you can't undo that or walk that back. That child has to suffer with what happened to them forever, for a very, very long time of suffering. And that is a lot of care and a lot of healing that needs to take place. And Jesus is the only one who can completely fix this kind of damage. This is why we try and protect our kids to our utmost. The horrific details come in a report from the Post Millennial, which explained the U.S. Attorney's Office for the Northern District in California revealed that Jace Wong, a woman who claims to be a man, was sentenced on charges of production, attempted production, distribution, and possession of child pornography. She was accused of abusing children left in her care in order to create and distribute child pornography. Wong admitted that the children were around four to six years of age and she had taken pictures and videos showing their genitalia. She then shared those images on the internet chat rooms with other predators like her. She was also accused of encouraging children to touch her in sexual ways. Her defense lawyers claimed her actions are because she was taking testosterone and it affected her sexual urges. So shame. We should look kindly on her because it's not her fault. It's the drugs. Really? This is evil in its very open form in your face. And it is coming for our children. And it is full on trying to destroy their innocence. It should not be tolerated and we should be watching like a hawk or an eagle around who is near or who has access to our children. In the times that we are living in people, there are predators everywhere. Protect these innocents. God bless. Keep looking up. Shalom.